How's it going, my Luke League? And welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Diamond Elimination Lock. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. And if you are, make sure you guys hit that like button down below. I would seriously appreciate that, guys. It takes one click, and that one click helps out so much. So we are here in Veilstone City. We made our way here last uh, last episode, actually. Listen to this music. It's actually it's pretty freaking hype, if you ask me. We actually did a bunch of grinding. When I say a bunch, I mean it's like pretty much like over 20 minutes of grinding, which I, I would consider that a fair amount. So I got everyone up to level 26. I really do hope that it is enough. We'll see. So Subtweet's level 26, Timid Nature. He's got the Tangled Feet ability, Peck, uh, Nightshade, Nasty Plot, and Shatter. So that's pretty legit. We actually didn't touch him at all. We just gave him the EXP share and let that do the work. Uh, then we have Psychic, the Metacham, who's Jolly Nature to get the Pure Power ability, Fake Out, Psycho Cut, Ice Punch, and Fire Punch. Of course, putting in work as usual. Nothing really special there except for the fact that he's a power Powerhouse. Then we have Hooter the Noctowl, who's in modest nature, with the Tinted Lens ability, Nightshade Wing Attack, and he finally learned Confusion in the Grinding Montage, so hopefully that will help out us very much. He's also got Hypnosis, so we can put things to sleep whenever we want to, because I get we're, we're, we're so boring, we'll just put people to sleep, right? Right? Nah! Alright. Uh, then we have Walk and Taku, who almost died to a self-destruct... Was it Geodude or Graveler? I think it was a Geodude, so thank god he held on. Um, he's got the Adamant Nature, Slow Start Ability, Dizzy Punch, Rock Smash, Knock Off, and he learned Super Power. That is going to put in a lot, a lot of work, but I'm going to have to be careful when I use it because it does minus your attack and defense. So then we have a Woody who is still carrying the EXP share. I just decided to give it back to him because the next gym really doesn't go in his favor. So I just decided, hey, why not? Whatever. So Woody's level 26. Uh, Adam and Nature's got the Rockhead ability, Fate Attack, Low Kick, Sand, uh, Sand Tube, and Rock Throw. So he's just chilling right there. And then last but not least, we have Wumbo. Wumbo the Wish Cash is uh, Adamant Nature. He's got the Anticipation ability. Uh, Dragon Dance Spark. He learned Magnitude, which is honestly going to freaking put in work and Water Pulse. So that is what Wumbo is chilling with. And our team is looking pretty freaking awesome right now. So one thing I do want to talk about before we actually start getting into this episode is I really hope that this episode turns out really nicely. Uh, last episode, the, there was no game audio. The episode before that, my mic was really close to my face, and everything is just falling apart. So hopefully I can provide more quality content for you guys, because I was really not satisfied with the last couple of this episodes. So hopefully this one is good. And uh, once again, I'm sorry for that, but it is what it is, guys. So let's just go ahead and talk to these people. Talk to these galactic goons. Hey, you. Yeah, you. This is Team Galactic's warehouse. I, it ain't a playground for kids. Oh, yeah, 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 okay, I have, to, I have to go up to here to the gym first, that's right, that's right, I got, you know, what am I doing, what am I doing, I'm such a noob, I haven't played Gen 4 in quite some time, so, you know, you can't really blame me, you can't really blame me, but, let's go up there, let's go straight up here, yeah, there she is, the one and only, Supra, are you going to take the gym challenge? Gee, you keep getting tougher and tougher, don't you? Me? Well, I went shopping at the department store, and, I mean, well, of course, I've been working on my Pokedex, but, I'll catch you later. Peace out, girlfriend. Peace out, girlfriend. So I guess we gotta go follow her, cause she, I think she loses her Poketch or something with the team. And the Team Galactic people pick it up, cause they're just thugs like that. So I don't know, straight thugging. And uh, right, we go up here, right? Hey, you. Yeah. You, hold on. Um, do I have to beat the gym first? I feel like I have to beat the gym first. Hold on. There is one thing that I do want to check real quick. I do want to make sure that I don't have to do anything first. Because I could have sworn we go and help her now, but I guess that's not the case. So let's go ahead and take on the gym. I'm actually kind of frightened. I'm not going to lie. Um, I am a little scared for this gym. Because I don't know if we're on par with the levels. I'm pretty sure we are. So we'll just, we'll just kind of see. One thing that I just had in mind is that I kind of want to put up Hooter. Because um, Subtweet's kind of frail. Like, I'm not going to lie. Subtweet's kind of frail. No, let me go down. Like, my Xbox control is really annoying. Like, it won't go down sometimes. So, we gotta actually put... No, hold up. Hold up. We're gonna do this. There we go. Alright, so Hooter is up front. So, let's just talk to this guy. Hey there, how's it going, champ to be? The gym leader is user of Fighting-type Pokemon. Should be a terror against Normal-type Pokemon. And, uh, but, it's it's a big butt. Uh, I like big butts and I cannot lie. Uh, uh, just between you and me, Maylene, the gym leader, said flying at Psychic-type Pokemon could be really tough, for, uh, really trouble for her. Alright, that's good to know. One thing that I just had in mind is, um, last episode was it, we got the Mind Plate, which increases the power of Psychic-type moves. So we go ahead and give that to Hooter, and I also think this increases Psychic-type moves, so why not? No, hold on, stop. I was going to get the Psychic, just in case we need to come in clutch with a, with a Psycho Cut here and there. Against her Lucario, because, spoiler alert, she, has, she does have a Lucario, so... Hopefully we'll be able to do this. And this gym, honestly, I remember giving me troubles. 
Um, I know how to do it, but like, it just gives me troubles. Cause it's like, I, it's hard to do. It's Don't get me wrong, it's a very hard gym to do. So uh, let's just try to wing attack this thing. Oh crap, I just realized this thing is level 28. Welp, um, that might be troublesome. That might be troublesome. That very, very well might be. Uh, so we're just gonna heal. We're just going to heal. I think we can do it, honestly. I really do. I have no doubts that we can do this, so we're just gonna we're just gonna see what we can do here. Yeah, this thing's lower leveled, so we should be. Able oh, that's just one shot. Holy crap! I know it was a crit, but dang, 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 dang. We oh, you're gonna call mine? Dang, you're gonna special attack? What are you doing? What are you doing out here in these parts? What are you doing, Metatite? Yeah, honestly, if we have a trouble with this gym, uh, that's me being stupid. <laughs> that's really just me being stupid, but um, I think we should be okay. Uh, Lucario, I am scared of, but I really don't think we should have very much of a problem with it. Uh, I really don't, but we'll see, definitely. Hit yourself. Not bad, not bad. And we do have hypnosis, so that could put in work. That could help us out. That definitely could. Leer and just catch a confusion. Here we go. Oh, takedown. Actually, I think I'm good on that. I don't really need residual damage. And look at that. Woody's leveling up. And I did... Oh, uh, I think... Okay, I still have not looked it up if Woody evolves with happiness. But I did give him a massage during the grinding montage. Because it's actually a lady that gives her Pokemon a massage. So, fun fact, we gave him a massage. Yeah, we pushed that over there. And then, um... Do we... Hold on. Um... Do we go up here, push that there, then I do think, do we, what the heck, um, no, 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 I got this, I got this, I got this, oh, no, 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 I don't, okay, we gotta, we gotta push this that way, push that that way, alright, alright, game plan, hold on, I can't get through here, this is a pro, hello, there we go, <laughs> there we go, uh, right here, and boom, shakalaka, not bad, so there's one of them. We just gotta go back down here. There we go. All right, so you on a battle? How's it going, dude? All right, uh, Machoke. All these guys have Machokes. Dang. Uh, we can just wing attack. Honestly, it really doesn't matter what we do. Machop, you're gonna bo get bodied by a confusion. Yep. Um, another Machoke. I keep getting scared of these Machokes. Ah, I can I can pretty much just do work to that. Oh God. Okay, never mind. Fine. But like I, I just get scared of them. I they're my chokes. They're look at their muscles. They're just they're scary. They're big scary human beings. Push that right there. Uh probably push this right there. Uh I don't know if actually that's fine, because now we just go like that. Okay. I think we can do that. Does that work? I think I yeah, we can get past. Okay, that's fine. Um you can go right there. Yo, oh, crap! I think we just did the puzzle. Hold up. Hold the phone! Hold- No! Now we have to go all the way over there. It's fine, we have to go over there anyways. But I think we actually did this puzzle. I think they make it hard- Yeah, in Platinum they have the, um, the punching bags, which is actually much more difficult in my opinion. Yeah, because now we can just take on this guy. Oh, we already did, right? Do we have to take you on? Sure, tough. Yeah! Wow, not bad. Oh my god, I'm honestly really nervous. I honestly am. Um, I want to think of a game plan for Lucario. Um, I think Psychic and Hooter should be able to handle it. Uh, it doesn't have like anything that can really hurt me so much. So I guess, I guess let's jump right into this gym. I know we are a little bit under leveled, and I do apologize for being unprepared. But I thought she was level 26 or level 27. But let's go ahead and take on the third gym leader, Maylene. Hello, I am pleased to meet you. I'm Aileen, and I'm the gym leader. I don't really know what it means to be strong or how, or how I got to be the gym leader, but I will do the best I can as a gym leader. I take battling very seriously whenever you're ready. Oh, all right, let's take on the gym leader, Maylene. Honestly, I said I am scared, and I kind of am scared. That is not anything that, can I, that I can shake. So hopefully we are going to be able to put in work against this thing. So let's send out Hooter. We are level 27, so that's good. Uh, let's go for a wing attack here. Just to get some damage off. Uh, how much is this gonna do? Do we get a crit? 
Oh, that's awesome. Because I feel like this thing was going to have like ice punch or something stupid like that. But we got it out of the way. Oh, that makes me feel very happy. That makes me feel very happy. Um, oh, I really wanted her to send out Lucario right now, but that's not going to be the case, unfortunately. So she is going to send out Hermit Choke right now. Which, I'm not going to lie, scares me. But I feel like we should be able to hit this thing up real quick with a confusion. And this should be able to do about as much damage as it did to all the other Machokes. So down to there. That's good. That's decent. Um, let's hope that she doesn't have, like, Rock Tomb. Leer. Perfect. But she probably is going to use a potion, which I am okay with. Because that does mean that she won't be using one on Lucario. She didn't use a potion, though. I'm not going to lie. That kind of makes me upset. That kind of scares me. Um, what I think I'm going to do is switch out to Medicham. Um, we do have Fire Punch. And Lucario is very frail. So I think Psychic might be able to handle this. And I think I should be able to live, live any one hit from this Lucario. I can pretty much say that proudly. I don't see this thing having like Aerial Ace uh, or anything like that. It's level 30. Oh my god. Alright, um, I'm going to try and just fake out just for damage, just for chip damage, just to see what we can do here. Um, that does a lot. Yo, hold on. I th fire punch. Yeah, okay. No! Aw, oh, crap. Why did I not think of Steadfast? Alright, come on. Bone. Yo, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, we ate that up. We ate that up. We are we are eating these hits. Yum. That is yummy. Mmm. Ah. Scrumptious. Scrumptious. Hit three times. Catch this fire punch. Scrumptious. Yum. Mmm. I love it. Tastes so good in my belly. Catch this fire punch. Oh my god, that action. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh my god. Hey, what a good level 28, not bad. Oh my god, guys. I shall admit defeat. You are, you are much too strong. Oh my god. Okay, you win. That was a tough loss. I learned a lot from it. Please accept this gym badge. Super receive the cobble badge. Yes, guys. Oh my god. That is decent. I was scared of that fight so much. <gasps> um, I should explain about that badge. If you have the official Pokemon League badge, you can use the hidden move fly outside of battle. Oh, and please take this as well. I think that's Drain Punch. I really hope it's Drain Punch. Uh, that TM contains Drain Punch. That move inflicts, da uh, inflicts damage and it robs HP from the target. Not bad. Let's try and teach it. We have a bunch of TMs that we should probably try to teach. Now that I think about it. Now that I think about it. I want to try and teach Drain Punch real quick. At some point, we'll probably just go ahead and teach a bunch of TMs to some Pokemon. Yo, you can learn it, but you already have... We need to get Fighting Stab on Psychic. Let's be real here. Because I think the only Fighting Stab that he actually gets is... um, What's it called? Uh, High Jump Kick, and we don't want to risk that. So... What do we have here? What move should we get rid of? I really like Fake Out. I really like Fake Out. I like Psycho Cut, of course. And we should... I feel... Okay. It's either Ice or Fire Punch. Uh, Metacham is weak to Flying. Metacham is weak to... Fairy, but that doesn't count. I'm just trying to think of what are the gyms that are coming up. Um... Honestly, I feel like we can get rid of fire. Uh, actually, what covers do you have? I feel like we can get rid of fire punch. Um, I think that should be okay. I think with hard scales, we can just teach it back, so it's not. It's honestly not that big of a deal. Um, if we want to, we can teach. We can just teach fly right now. Why don't I heal you up? We're just gonna go back to the Pokemon Center. Don't ask me. But guys, we beat the gym leader. Yes, I was actually so glad that we beat Maylene. That is honestly a huge lump off my back. Oh, now, now is where she's coming for our help. Hi, Super, please, can you help me? I dropped my Pokedex uh, by accident and Team Galactic found it. And then they won't give it back. Please, I need your help. I'll be waiting in front of the warehouse. Please come. For some reason, I thought we had fly, and that's why I said that, um, that we could go and fly right now, but we can't even teach fly, so, because we don't have it. So there you go. 
Also during the grunting match, I the grunt, grunting match, I, I just did a bunch of trainer battles. I went down from the route here, uh, down to the route under Veilstone City. Not really under, just the south from it, I guess you could say. And uh, I just battled all the trainers there because wild Pokemon takes so long, and those trainer battles are just going to take up time from an episode. And I also went to that one tower that I said we were going to need Defog for, and apparently that's only in Platinum, so I got TM Strength right there. Which is honestly pretty good, meaning that we don't have to come back for it sometime later. Because I honestly, w I didn't know we were going to get it. But here's Miss Dawn right here. And who do we want to lead with? Who do we want to lead with? Because Hooter, uh, I, need, I need more friends. Uh, <laughs> honestly, we haven't seen much play with Chat Todd, so we'll do that. I'm game. What's good, Dawn? Hi, Super. Please, can you help me? I dropped my Pokedex by accident and Team Galactic found it. Now they won't give it back. Please, I need... She just said the exact same thing that she did earlier. I don't understand. Will you battle with me? Yes, I will. You and your Pokemon together with me and my Pokemon united like this? Our dream team has, will never lose. I'm not letting these bad people get away with their dirty deeds. I'm actually going to take a sip of water real quick. I actually got to put my controller down. I like how Team Galactic didn't even say anything. They just kind of just were like, all right. That was a big swig of water. If you guys can't tell, I'm still a little under the weather. Just a little bit, though. Um, I, I love this series, so I'm not going to let a little cold just you know stand in my way of recording it. I think it's so fun. I'm so glad I'm doing a Nuzlocke. Nuzlocke, honestly, are like insanely fun. I'm going to take the Krogunk out because that's a little more of a threat, in my opinion. There's a little more of a threat. Except this Beautifly is putting in work. This Beautifly is putting in work with this Gust. Stunky, you should die to that, right? You didn't. Oh crap, that's that kind of sucks. Mud bomb, thank you. All right, cool. Oh, that stinks. Our Pokemon are chups. We should get new ones from headquarters. Huh, who cares about some Pokedex anyway? Team Galactic's going to own all the Pokemon in the world. No, in the universe. There, take it. Take your Pokedex. Those things that we had in the warehouse, we've already been moved to Passoria City anyways. So we'll say, you'll get yours and run like the grunts we are. What's going on? Why is Team Galactic out in the streets like they own the place? Super, thank you sincerely. Uh, if Professor Roan ever finds out that I lost my Pokedex, ew, I don't want to think about it. So Super, what are you going to do now? I'm thinking of going to Pastoria City now. The Great Marsh, uh, there is the home to many kinds of Pokemon. Well, I'll see you later, girl. And I actually want to heal real quick, so we don't have to worry about someone dying on the way we uh, on the way back. But I do think that there is some cool stuff in here. So hold on. Um, what's this? Oh, fly! <laughs> I honestly didn't know that. What's good, dude? What's good? Oh, what do you have here? Our team, Gal team Galactic, yada yada, Valley Inworks. Oh, what is this about? I don't really care, man. I don't really care. So we are here. We are here now. Where to next? I think we just go to Pastoria, right? Am I am I correct? I think it's just off to Pastoria City. I'm really just trying to think. I think we go to Pastoria. We go to get. Uh, we go face Wake. Then um. Uh, da 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 da. Then we have to go p face Fantina. Then we go face uh Byron. Then Candace. And then Lady. And I don't even know. So whatever. Well, that's if we lose. I mean, of course. Alright, so I just want to make sure real quick, because I know some guy does appear up there, and it's not now, because I'm just jumping the gun, of course. Um, yeah, I'm okay with this. I still want to keep that EXP share on Bob Bonsly, just until he gets maybe level 30, because I don't really like to train him. I really don't. You guys can probably tell that. Uh, he take, he's like, he's, okay, he's not the strongest Pokemon in the world. I don't think anyone can disagree. I love him. I honestly am so glad that he is on our team. But, he's a pain in the ass to train, so... Yeah, I do want to go ahead and grab this Pokeball, though. It's a big root. I don't think I have any Pokemon that take E. Uh, hold up. This thing, These things carry self-destruct. Gotta run away. Yeah, I... Oh, my God. If I lost Regigigas to that uh, ex explosion... Not explosion, self -de If it was explosion, I would have surely died to that self-destruct. I would have pooped everywhere. Like, I literally would have just pooped all over my computer and everything. Just poop everywhere. Just poop is just, ev poop is literally everywhere. Like that is how bad it is. So you want to find your sweet key. No one really cares. Oh, what's this? What is this? What is this? Oh okay. yeah. Oh, you guys battle, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, 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 okay. A Goldie. Yo, Finneon. I'm sorry, Finneon, but Finneon is like a very irrelevant Pokemon. No one ever remembers Finneon. I'm sorry, Finneon. I really am. 
Finneon, you you seem like a good guy. You know, you honestly seem like a good dude, but no one remembers you. I'm sorry, Finneon. I'm sorry, and I and I don't think I stand alone when I say that. Finneon is just irrelevant. Luminion is cool. Don't get me wrong. Luminion is honestly freaking cool. But Finneon, on the other hand, if I if I were to ask you what water like today, all the water Pokemon, I guarantee you would skip Finneon. You'd probably skip Luminion too. But like, like if you if you got Luminion, you'd get Finneon. But let, let's let's say the majority of people don't even know Finneon exists. So I'm just gonna leave it at that because I feel like this is way too, I'm getting way too much into this like. Art, it's not even an argument, just like me just talking. I'm getting way too into it when I shouldn't be, and it's a Bronzor. Uh, let's just, how much, oh, we don't, we can't fire punch it anymore. So we just gotta kind of just chip it, uh, that, that killed it. All right, cool. I'm glad that did, because that thing was getting a pain in the butt to train. A pain in the butt. Uh, let's, let's get over to the sting. I do want to see if we have a PP up, though. Um, is that possible? We do, because uh, I I noticed that Drain Punch should uh should get some of that. That is very nice. How's it going, dude? All right, I'm a fan of Allison. I don't know who Allison is honestly, but I am a fan of Allison. I guess I I I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Uh, that that should just do it. That should do that. This little slur of events. Bop. Yep. Bop, bop, bop. Bop, 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 bop to the top. Yo, High School Musical was amazing. Anyone that denies it is a lying. That's true. Proven fact. End of story. End of story. And uh, follow me. Why are you following me? I'm, I'm following you anyways. You're the only person I can follow. I don't really understand what you're doing here, but whatever, man. Whatever, man. All right. We're just, we're just coming. We just come into this person's restaurant. Beat the crap out of every single trainer in here. And just people just give us money and then we leave. I love that. I think that's hilarious. Uh, we'll just cycle cut you. It honestly doesn't matter. Get that crit, nice and crit, and you should catch a cycle cut and bop. A Palm, yo, A Palm is honestly a Pokemon that I forget, but I love. I love A Palm. I think it's awesome. I think it's awesome. So here I think is our last trainers. I mean, here I think is our last trainers. Here are our last trainers. Yo, that's actually kind of scary, yo. I'm gonna double team it with Fake Out. All right, cool, we got rid of it. I was gonna say, that's kind of scary, but we do have Fake Out. Yo, why did I not think? Okay, we gotta switch out. We're switching out, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Um, Rock and Taco and Wumbo. Wing attack, nothing. You ain't doing nothing. All right, uh, we can just dizzy punch you, and we can just spark you, cause you just gotta ignite. Yo, the halftime show. I'm recording this, and you guys aren't gonna see this for a while. Probably at least a week after the Super Bowl. But that half, yo, Katy Perry. That was it. That was a very entertaining halftime show. I love when she pulled out the pyroar, and she made me believe that Pokemon were real, and she rode that pyroar. If you guys know what I'm talking about, you could. There's probably a clip on YouTube it, uh, YouTube of it by now, but. Uh, basically, Katy Perry halftime show. It was decent. Look at that. Another PP up right after I mentioned it. Not bad. Not bad at all. So I believe up here this guy's just like. Uh, no, this guy gives us some stuff for like a poke hedge or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I remember. I, I know what's up. I know what's up. And then there's like a bunch of rock climb puzzles. They're not even puzzles. They're just like a bunch of rock climb things. Uh, what is this? Uh, music? Hello, dude. Take this. TM92, what was that? Trick Room, right? Yeah, that is Trick Room. That's actually kind of cool, but I don't think any of our Pokemon really are slow enough and or can learn Trick Room, so... I mean, Noctile might be able to learn Trick Room and make use of it, so that's kind of decent, but... That's not really to an interest of mine. Uh, what is this? Mount Moon. Yes, there are Clefairy at Mount Moon. Yeah, I, I, actually, there's barely any Clefairy, right? Like, when you go there... Actually, hold on. Something just sparked my mind. Now, nah, no. Right here. Because you heal me, right? Yeah. All right, cool. So now, um, we get, is this a red shard? It is a red shard. I do. I actually, I, I have a good memorization of where my items are on my in my game. Like, I, I, it's just something that comes to me naturally. So that's pretty cool. Uh, Chatter you. So is it, I thought Chatter had a 100% chance to confuse. 
Rock Tomb. Thank God we didn't waste our TM on that. That would have been kind of annoying, honestly. When does Bond Sly freaking evolve? We'll let him take this EXP share off of you. Uh, yeah, we can just keep you up there. That don't matter. But it don't matter, though. Alright, so what does this man have? A Shellos. Shellos is honestly freaking cool. Like, Shellos is just legit. Shellos is just legit. And we'll just go for Chatter. One shot that Shellos. But yeah, I thought Chatter had 100% to confuse. Is that only in Gen 6? Or does it not have 100% confuse in Gen 6? I don't know. For some reason, I thought it did. Well, I'm stupid. How's it going, dude? Alright, good talk, man. How's it going, dude? Ah, you want a battle. See? I freaking knew it. I knew it. I knew there was someone around here. Chatter you. Yeah, I keep forgetting we have Nasty Plot. Like, we can just set up all over people and just sweep them. We can. And you're gonna get bodied. Oh, crap. Oh, my God. I don't know why I went for another Chatter there. And that honestly makes me upset. Because what if I actually died? What if? What if that happened? That would suck. That would really freaking suck. And no one can deny. I just don't want to lose Pokemon. Like, that's pretty much it. I just really... I have a fear of losing Pokemon in Nuzlocke. I really do. Mimic. That's actually kind of interesting. I love how they gave a chat type Mimic. I think that is honestly so cool. Because, okay, he's like a... What's, what are those freaking... Not pigeons. What the hell are they called? Um... Aerial Ace. Yo, that's actually kind of decent. Hold on. Hold the phone. I love this generation makes me so happy how they automatically organize the number of TMs. That makes me so happy. Um, sadly, only those guys, but you know, it's whatever. It's whatever. Something on the top of it. Yeah, there is. There's like a TM up there, right? Or I feel like it's a protein or something that like we really don't need. That's not worth going for rock climb or anything. Like, I don't know why they make you have to go get. What is rock climb? This eighth, not the seventh, not, not the eighth gym badge, the seventh gym badge. And they make you they make you have it just to get a protein. I don't understand. Because I can just buy one. I don't I don't get it. But we're here in Pastoria City. Yep, Pastoria City. And let's go ahead and heal up real quickly. But guys, I think that is going ahead and be this episode. If you guys did happen to enjoy this episode of the Pokemon Eliminate uh, Pokemon Diamond Elimination Lock, make sure you guys hit that like button down below, because that would honestly make me super happy. It helps out the series so much and lets me know you guys are enjoying what you're seeing. Thank you guys so much for checking out this video. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.